We begin tonight with some new numbers on how Houston County is booming. Last week, we told you Houston County moved up to become the state's 14th largest county. Perry helped fuel that rise. It is the fastest growing area of Central Georgia's fastest growing county. Perry's population rose nearly 50% in the past decade, more than 6,700 new people. Warner Robins grew by more than 13,000 people. That's about a 20% increase. And Centerville increased by 15% with over 1,000 more people. Brianna Richardson spent the day in Perry talking to folks about their population boom. Brianna joins us live with more about why people are moving to town and why they're staying. Yeah, business owners here in downtown Perry say they've definitely seen that boom. Michelle Rhodes owns Mossy Creek Natural, and she says the more people coming in brings a bigger economic impact. Rhodes moved to Perry in 2006. She says the school system and quality of life are some factors that's kept her family here. When we came downtown, we remember that a lot of the storefronts had not been remodeled. A lot of them were empty and they were for rent because it was like right around that downturn of the economy. So there's a huge difference between what was then and what is now. In downtown, she opened her store Mossy Creek Natural in 2015. Since then, she says her revenue has doubled. So the foot traffic has increased, you know, the infrastructure as far as the people that are in place to keep the events going, you know, the the exposure that we're getting as far as downtown as a whole, you know, everything is 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 contributing to our sales down here. Perry's economic development administrator Ashley Harden says affordable housing, city events and parks and rec play a role in the growth. They have some target areas developers want to build on. And so with that, we're going to see additional growth and just more people that want to locate here. We're going to see new construction um, at several areas all over Perry, uh, both Courtney Hodges, Sam Nunn, um, this location as well. She says Perry's centralized location and the fairgrounds makes it an ideal hot spot. You can pretty much get, be at the beach or in the mountains in three hours, so we're excited about that. Um, the new hotel coming to the convention center will provide an opportunity for conferences in the middle of the state that will bring people from all over. How are you guys doing today? Good. Rhodes Good. says she doesn't Good. plan on leaving. And they're on the path, I mean, of creating this community to where you don't have to leave to go anywhere. You know, it's just awesome to be able to walk downtown for the people that live in Perry and they can go to an event or go to a restaurant and walk back home. Everyone says the city has become a live, work, play community and they hope to continue growing. Live in Perry, Brianna Richardson, 13 WMAZ News. All right, thank you, Brianna. Ashley Harden says the hotel at the Georgia National Fairgrounds will cost about $14 million. The plan is to begin construction next year.